shouldn't be. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She just didn't Absolutely. like the backside. She didn't like the racetrack. Yeah, why? Yeah. thing. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. She just didn't like racing. She likes children and being lazy. <laughs> yeah. So she yeah, lived she up to her, her name at job. the racetrack. That's, <laughs> that's funny. That's a great name. Yeah, I love it. I love it. And what, what color is she? She is dark brown, almost, almost, um, she's registered as bay, um, but she's pretty close to being a brown color and she doesn't have any white on her except one little spot on her foot. And she dapples out beautifully in the summer, but in the winter time, her nose goes very light brown and the rest of her goes very dark and she really looks like a mule then. So <laughs> she earns her mule nickname. Yeah. Oh, wow. That is so cool. So how do, how do people get involved? How do they, how do they find you? And, um, you have some board positions open, is that right? We do. Um, we used to, our board, we kind of kept it local, but now with today's technology, Skype and everything, meetings aren't such a bad thing and are, they're pretty easy to do online nowadays. And we just find that We'd love to expand to people that are in different areas with open ideas because um, we just want to see where this can go. I mean, it's, sure. it's been getting bigger every year, especially since 2013 when Ontario canceled the spots at racetracks program, um, which cut a lot of the funding to the standard bred racetracks and almost 10,000 horses lost um, their ability to race because there just wasn't the money and the ability and the yeah. tracks to run it. So standard breds have been quickly needing homes and so we've been growing very rapidly and we would just love people's new ideas um, sure. of where sure. they think we should go what so. is what is the website so our website is www.goandplaystables.org uh, um, okay. it's pretty easy it to is, find thankfully goandplaystables.org Okay. I hope everybody um, yeah. checks them out because it's uh, a really, really great charity and um, something that's very much needed. So uh, thank you, Kimberly, so much for coming on. And we so appreciate having um, had the time to talk to you and learn more about what you're doing. And, um, you know, go, go give Hooch a, a hug for all of us. <laughs> thank you. I will. And thank you so much for having me. I appreciate having the ability to come on and just talk about what I love so much. <laughs> you are very welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Kim.